All right, today's meal is going to be beef stew and pasta. So you take you some beef tips. I like to cut mine up a little bit thinner than this. Then we're going to put it over in the crock pot. All right, so now we got all of our beef tips over into the crock pot. Now we're going to add garlic powder, onion powder, and a pack of brown gravy. Mm. All right, we got our onion powder in there. Now we're getting ready to go with the garlic powder. Now we're getting ready to go with a little bit of um, season oil. Put that in there nice and easy. Now I'm getting ready to add one pack of this brown gravy. Alrighty. In goes our brown gravy. There we go. Now we're going to take one glass of water. There we go. And let me move some of this stuff out of my way. I've got it on high for four hours. There you go. So we're going to mix that in good and let it cook for four hours. And then after that, we'll go ahead on and make some pasta to throw in there with it. Alright, it is smelling so good. So good. And see how we got that broth for when our noodles get done, but not going to cook the noodles just yet. We still got an hour and 55 minutes to cook the meat. Alrighty, my meat is all done. I got my pasta cooked and washed off. Now we're getting ready to add it. Right, let me stir that in. Shut up. Before I got cut off. Shout out to Coupon Panda for showing me this meal. Let's get it all mixed in. I'll show y'all what it looks like once I get it all mixed in. Look at the smoke coming off of it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go and do a taste test, shall we? Mm -mm. Let me tell you, you can taste the beef flavor. You can taste that gravy powder, even though it's not gravy. Um, and you can most definitely taste the onion powder. I really can't taste the garlic powder, but that's, that's a good twist on it. I got this, copy this recipe from Coupon Panda Turn Teacher. I'll leave a link below to her video. Um, I think this recipe is good for a family.